So what are the early symptoms of keratoconus? Well, typically these are young people in their teens, early 20s, and they notice declining vision, blurring of vision. Often it's when they're studying and they're putting their vision under a bit more strain, they may cover one eye accidentally when rubbing their eye and notice that the, the other eye is not seeing so well. They hadn't noticed before because when both eyes were open, they had good function and could, and could cope with their vision. Very commonly these are people with hay fever, allergies, they're people who rub their eyes a bit more often and uh, it is thought that that's part of what causes the condition. So understandably when people notice that they've got blurring of vision their first port of call is usually to their optometrist and their optometrist may identify that they have astigmatism as well as short-sightedness affecting the focusing of light. That astigmatism is occurring because the cornea, the window at the front of the eye, has become distorted. It's steeper in certain areas than others, and that's twisting the light and degrading the quality of the vision. And, and that's really the hallmark of, of keratoconus.